Welcome to this video tutorial on how to use the AimTrailers Color Helper plugin from AimTrailers Explainer Video Toolkit version 2 for Adobe After Effects. Okay, so after we open the After Effects, um, let's open the plugin. So just go to the Windows tab and then select that. This small plugin has only one function, but it's really cool. So as you know from our previous version, our toolkit has a lot of high quality and detailed icons and objects. And if you wanted to change the color before, it was necessary to find the resources folder of our template, and then you find the category of each icon, and then you change the color using Adobe Illustrator. Long process, wasn't it? But with this plugin, and just with one click, we can convert any icon to shape version. And pay attention, here will be the automatically created color controls. So let's import one of the AIM trailers icons category. Yeah, this will be nice. Just click import. Okay, now let's open one of them. Now just click this big pretty button here. We can see new shape layers, forget about these. You must then select AIM Trailers Color Control Layer. Then next you go to the Effects Control Panel. So we can see some color controls. So let's make a couple of changes here. Yeah, it's really this easy and fast. So no matter which type of icons you use, whether it's animated or static, it's exactly the same way. Also, you can press this button here to remove the shape version on an object if you want to return the color to the original value. So let's consider another situation. Okay, so let's import one of AimTrailer's buildings template. Yeah, like this one, this will be nice. Now open any of the buildings. Okay, this one is okay. As you can see, the building contains glare. In other words, these parts are made using transparency in the source file of the Adobe Illustrator. So let's try and convert that. As you can see, unfortunately, transparency cannot be transferred to the shape layer when converting from a vector layer. But not to worry, these parts are converted to white or black color and you can always adjust them in the right shade. So for example, just like this. Yeah, that looks great. So now you know how to use this small but incredibly powerful and useful plugin. And that's all. So this video guide for this section is over. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for all the latest updates on new products and offers.